Hello everyone, and welcome back to our Dark Souls playthrough. In the last episode, we got our final Lord Soul from the Four Kings. So now that we have all four Lord Souls, we can make it to the final area of the game and beat it. Hello, Mr. Spaghetti Worm. I am pleased to see you well. Is it something urgent? Yes. Warp. Hang on, real quick, I want to see something. Yeah. Are there... Oh, no, there's not colored shards. It's... Oh, it's the... I thought there was... I just want to test that real quick. Go ahead and eat me. Mmm, yummy. Tastes like kitchen utensils. This is probably not the last video I'm going to do on Dark Souls. I might, I'm going to do another episode where I go around and fight the bosses I haven't done yet. So there's one more video after this one. Which I've already recorded it. It's just because once you beat the game, you're immediately thrown into New Game Plus and start from the beginning again, but with all your stuff. But I'm going to upload this first. So, it's going to be a little out of order. Look how giant this dude is. He's got a nice stash. Oh, for souls. This is probably going to be a much shorter episode. Probably like... 10, 12 minutes long, unless I die, which I hope I won't. We open the door and fire the altar. We can go to the final area. First, let's talk to Mr. Fancy Spaghetti, or whatever I call him. Ah, the Lord Vessel is satiated. Magnificent. You are the righteous successors of which I am keen seeker no more. Your acquaintance was an honor. I must admit, I am fond of you humans. May you enjoy serendipity, and may the age of fire perpetuate you. Oh, now yeah, here we go. Also, um, hang on, that button was made. Can I use it? Just I noticed something the other day here, which I kind of wanted to point out. Uh, we had to go to Anne Armando all the way through Sin's Fortress and Two Bells and all that shenanigans to get a Lord Vessel. When the whole time... There's one over there. Just get closer to it. I just noticed this, like, the other day, that there's two Lord Vessels, which... What about our, all these? Are these just torches? Why are there two Lord Vessels, huh? Why can't we just walk over here, grab this one, and put it on the altar? Do we just need a specific one from the, that lady? Anyway, we can go to the final area. areas, but first we have to walk through the white abyss, or whatever this area is supposed to be. There's black knights walking around. Here we are. Final area. Killing of the first flame. I really like the look of this place. It's really cool. And it's the only area of the game where black knights are normal enemies. So, you know what that means? Run past everyone. Just make it to the boss. There's one with an ultra great sword. Giant sword, he's still really fast. You can also get Black Knight armor here, but I actually don't think it's as good as the Silver Knight armor, so I'm gonna keep this on. There's a, oh, he just has 
sword. Nerd. Also, I think this is this walkway has the only black knight with a great axe. Because I'm fairly certain that this is a unique black knight who doesn't appear anywhere else in the game. He might appear in different versions, but as far as I know, this is the only area where you can find one with a great axe. Anyway, let's heal real quick. When is the god? Final boss. Win, Lord of Cinder. Also, since I'm using a fire weapon, and he has fire resistance, so we're just gonna parry him. He's the only boss in the game that can be parried. Although I do want to kill him with a normal attack, because he has a better death animation. Spawn. We did it. Soul of Gwyn. Alright, I guess that's it. The shortest episode in the series is also the second to last one. Now, we can either choose one of two endings. We can either just walk out, or we can link the fire, which I am going to do. Alright, let's end the game. Link the fire. Dunzo. And we have beaten the game. And yeah, I was playing Dark Souls Remastered, not the original, because I would like to play a version of Dark Souls where the target actually works. Another nice quality of life changes. Let's get the credits. Yes, I can. So. The reason I wanted to record the video where I fight all the bosses I skipped before beating the game was because we're thrown straight back into the unde undead asylum. Yes, That's good. Which, now we're in New Game Plus. We have all our stuff, but we're back to the start of the game. As you can see, we have all our stuff still. We can our soul of Gwyn, but none of our keys. So that's going to do it for this episode. I'm not going to keep going into New Game Plus, but yep, yeah, we've beaten Dark Souls. So there will be one more video after this where I go around and fight all the bosses that I skipped and optional bosses as well. So thank you for watching and have a good day.